Hey there! Welcome back to EMP Monitor How to Tutorial Series. In today's video, I am going to show you how to add employees using EMP Monitor. EMP Monitor is a powerful cloud based employee management software that helps to track and increase their productivity and maintain a safe work environment. Log in to the EMP Monitor account using the basic information. Here's the main dashboard. Get the detailed overview from here about the total enrollments, currently active, currently idle, currently offline, absent, suspended. Let's get a detailed overview of the employees. Click on the employee's name. A pop-up window with all the details of the employees will appear, including office time, active time, productive time, unproductive time, neutral time, productivity. Check the details for today, yesterday, past 7 days, 30 days, etc. Manage the filter graph from here. Next, you can check the employee's details using the timesheets. The report comes with the following special columns. Clock in. The time when the system starts for the first time on a particular day. Clock out. It will update after some time, so the clock out time will keep on changing which means until it gets updated from the system it will continue to change. Once the system doesn't give the update then it will save the last updated time as clock out time. Total hours. Represent the total time spent between clock out and clock in. Office hours. Represent the total time spent in the office. Active hours. Represents the total number of times when activities are performed in the system. Productive. Represents time spent on productive websites and applications, based on the classification you made. Unproductive. Refers to any time not spent on productive web pages, applications that are classified as unproductive. Neutral. Neutral time refers to the time an employee spends on neutral URLs. URLs and applications used by users by default assigned as neutral. Idle. Idle represents the absence of activity on the keyboard and mouse break time. Break time refers to the meal periods, or break period of an organization. Productivity percent. Refers to the percentage of the time productively spent on the official system. Next is screenshots. To view your employee's screen, select the scroll bar to see all the screens. Next, select the date and time frame. Click on search. You will get all the screenshots for that particular date in thumbnails. Get a complete overview of the top website usage and website usage chart. Top application usage, application usage chart. Keystrokes of each employee. Get a detailed overview of the employees, risk factor, domain, category, connection, sentiment score, conversation score. So, this was a quick overview of how to check and manage employees' full details from the dashboard. If you need any help or face issues while managing the attendance of the employees, feel free to write to us at support at or contact us over Skype.